Welcome to the canal with Melly Mel. I'm Melissa. Today I have a really exciting video. On a previous video, I had shown my entire Disney store key collection up to that point, how I am currently displaying those keys. Today, we'll be adding one more key to the collection. Just to do a quick recap, I am using coin display cases such as this one to display my keys. I have two of these so far. And as you can see, I only have space for one more, which is great because we're adding one more key today. On Star Wars Day, May the 4th, Disney released its latest Disney Store key. And as I had mentioned on a previous video, I was really bummed that I was not able to get one during the release. I totally missed out on the key. I mean, that was a crazy online release. I was happy that I was able to get my two May the 4th Be With You 2020 pins, the one with the Stormtrooper and the one with Yoda. So I was happy that I was able to get that, but uh, yeah, I was super bummed about the key. Luckily, my friend Gunso from The Adventures of Gunso, who I do my Sunday morning live stream with, he was kind enough to trade me a key because he was able to get two keys. So he traded me one for some Star Wars pins that he wanted. So I'm so happy we were able to make the trade. And without further ado, let's check out this key. All right, so this is the key right here, as you can see. It says Star Wars right at the one end of the key right here. We also see a nice pattern on the day in the Disney Store key. If we were to look at it this way, it looks like a lightsaber where this bottom part right here could be the hilt and then the blue portion of the key could be the actual lightsaber. And just like most of the Disney Story keys, we have a little tag right here. It says, may the fourth be with you. Such a cool key. I mean, this highly themed. When you see this, you can definitely say, "Hey, this is a Star Wars key." I mean, it also says Star Wars right on it. But I think it's pretty. It's pretty cool. I think it's nicely themed, and I think it's gonna look nicely inside the display box. The one thing about the display box is that I have to remove the card, otherwise it won't really fit. But I've been keeping all of my cards from all of my Disney Store keys and the little uh, gold thread right here that goes with it. So give me just one second. I'm gonna take this out and I'm gonna put it in the box. So I'll be right back. Ta-da! Here's the key. No card, no string. Here's my card right here. As you can see, everything is in one piece, so that way I can keep my cards. And now, here we go. So, let's put that key in there. And there we have it, guys. This is the last key that fits in this box, so it's time to get another display box for my keys. And it fits nicely right underneath the Cinderella key, which was also a highly wanted key. So I'm so excited to add this to my collection. Gunso, again, thanks so much for trading me that key. And let me know in the comments down below if you guys were able to get the Star Wars Day key or if you're collecting any other Disney Store keys. I cannot wait to get a new key. So hopefully Disney will come out with another fun key to collect. And as usual guys, if you love the things that I talk about, definitely subscribe, comment, like, and hit that notification bell so that you can keep looking out with me. Bye.